goes to prison to visit her husband, who has been sentenced for 40 years. Oh, Roger! 40 years, Roger! Well, my love, what are you going to do? Oh, Roger, I spoke to the lawyer that's handling your case. And what did he say, my love? He told me that every time I sleep with him, he'll reduce your sentence by one year. What? Oh, that miserable bastard. What did you say to that son of a... Oh, Roger, we'll talk about it at home. Pick up your stuff. Let's go. Olive. Well, when I was pregnant with her, all I wanted to do was eat olives. Okay, and why is my other sister called Maple? Again, when I was pregnant with her, all I wanted to do was eat maple syrup. Ah, okay. Thanks, Mummy. No problem, Bunny. Excuse me? Oh, uh, I think I'll live. How's your head? And this man had a son that said, just horny, so I was laughing. And I picked up my drink and I was like, cheers, brother, me too. And he gave me this weird look and I was like, what the fuck? And it was the same feeling that I get like when I see an old person eating alone or when I watch hoarders and the light turned green. So I, I started to go and I reread his sign. And it said, just hungry. Oh my god. Oh. Okay, gorgeous. Touch your shoulder. Put your hand on your waist. Spread your lips. Touch your lips. The lips on your face. <laughs> you have your husband? I'm sorry, ma'am. I cannot disclose that kind of information. I love doing this. I understand your frustration. What's his last name? Mm -hmm. That is all I can do. It is the hotel policy. F the policy, girl. He's here. He was here last week, too, with different girls. I understand your frustration, ma'am, but this is all I can do. Here, here. Say that you found this on the floor. Go in there right now. They just ordered champagne, girl. It's about to get messy. Can you, can you call me when you're in there, though? I want to listen, you know what I mean? A little credit for helping you out. No? No, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but... Go there right now. I'm sorry, ma'am. Have a good day. Go right now. I'm just trying to keep up with traffic. Well, there isn't any traffic. I know. That's how far behind I am. And now I'm going to be even further behind. Calls answer the phone call like this. Charlie's Whorehouse. If you've got the dough, we've got the hoe. Fancy a blow? Oh, hey, sweetheart. I didn't know you was already at home. How was work? Oh, hey, baby. Work? Work was long as hell today. How long? It was like three hours. I was like, damn, how long can he go? Was it good? It, it was good and all. I mean, it, it's always good. Oh, sweet Jesus. <laughs> And keep well. Okay, thanks, doctor. Excuse me, doctor. How's my husband? Your husband is suffering from a very severe stress disorder, and if you don't do the following, he will surely die. 
Oh my. Each morning, prepare him a healthy breakfast. Be pleasant at all times. For lunch, make him a nutritious meal. And for dinner, make him a specially nice meal. No chores, no nagging. Oh yes, and make love several times a week. Do this for a year and he'll regain his health completely. Thank you. What did the doctor say? You're gonna die. Stay so kids eat free today. Oh wow, that's amazing. Oh wow. Sure is. So what can I get for you? Well, I'm not really that hungry, so I'm just gonna have a water. Okay. And what about you, Derek? I'm gonna start off with the chicken tenders and the french fries. And I'll have the T-bone steak. Medium well. Loaded baked potato, cornbread, and the core is light. And then that's everything. Dad, WAP stood for wings and pizza. No, no. I'm, I'm highly aggravated. Now, he just invited all of our friends over for WAP. That's not what it stands for. It's not Winks and Pizza. Oh, it is for Loki, Iron Man, Hulk, Wonder, Quill, Paris, for... What? Why is it such a long password? Oh, it's because it asks for at least six characters, one capital and one number. Let me just memorise it. Oh, God, Mum. His shirt and a blonde says, wow, what a great chest you have. He said, that's 100 pounds of dynamite, babe. The guy takes off his pants and the blonde says, wow, what massive calves you have. He says, that's 100 pounds of dynamite, babe. Then the guy takes off his underwear and the blonde runs away screaming in fear. So the guy chases her and asks her, why did you run away from me like that? The blonde replies, I was afraid to be around all that dynamite when I saw how short the fuse was. It is, especially for men, because here's what happens. When you start dating somebody, you know your first thing is like, all right, you see the girl and you're like, I want to get in there. That would be, or however you phrase it in your head. Right. <laughs> and then you go out a few dates, and as you get closer to the act, the magical act happening, a lot of times a woman will ask a guy. She'll be like, oh, so like, what are you into? What do you like? And this is when a man's brain goes, don't scare her. You could fuck this up for us. So we lie to you, and we're like, oh, I like to hold hands, and uh, I like if you go on my neck, that's cool. Then you get married, and you're like, I want you to yank on my ball bag like you're stuck at sea, and this is the only motor that's going to take you home. A lot of girlfriends can't handle that shit. Girlfriends will be like, oh, what? But a wife will go, that it? And you're like, oh, yeah, I get you for like 50 years. She's like, yeah, I'll spit butter in your ass, whatever you want, man. There'll be no knifing one another. Everybody knows who's in charge. <sighs> Me. Right? Yes, you. <laughs> of course. Of course. Excuse me. I don't know what hole I'm on. Oh, no problem. Um, I'm on the seventh hole, and you're a hole behind me, so you're on the sixth hole. Thank you so much. Excuse me, I am so sorry. I, I forgot what hole I'm on again. No worries. I'm on the 14th and you're on the 13th hole. Thank you. Hey, um, let me buy you a drink to show you my appreciation for your help. That's so nice. I can't stay too long. I have a work meeting soon. What kind of work do you do? Sales. Oh, me too. What do you sell? If I told you, you would only laugh. No, I wouldn't. I sell tampons. <laughs> See, I knew you'd laugh. <laughs> That's not what I'm laughing at. I'm a toilet paper salesman, so I'm still one hole behind you. Um, 
we got into an argument, honey. He's uh, he's in the garden. No, I looked. He's not there. Did you dig? Speeding. Name, please. Wilma. Surname? Dick Fitz. Wilma Dick Fitz. Rip up that speeding ticket and you'll find out. Sweetheart, lunch is ri- What are you doing? Oh, mom, I'm trying to be religious like you. I'm praying. That is so great. That is great. You keep doing that. Yeah, mom, I'm hoping if I pray the way you do, I can get an Xbox. Yes, pray for a lot of money. Okay, mom, leave me alone. I'm going to pray. Okay, I'm not looking. Oh, God, yeah. That you, um, you had, you, you,